Hey, what's going on you guys? It's Toby's Talk Show and today we are back with another video. This is my third video of the day. The other two were a little shorter. This will be a little longer and today we are talking about the Michigan and Maryland game. So you guys absolutely love my my last college basketball review. Actually, it was my best video I've ever posted uh, views, likes wise, and comments. So thank you guys so much for that. Let's see if we could uh, replicate that today. Uh, but this was a great game. Uh, Maryland came out hot, uh, and I believe they're up like eight um, with a few minutes left in the half, and then Michigan rolled back. Uh, it was a tie game at halftime, I believe, or very close. And then in the second half, Michigan just kind of slowly but surely took the lead uh, and expanded it where it was kind of unbeatable. Right now, uh, I am the game's not 100% over, but Michigan's up 11 with two and a half with two free throws. Um, so the game should be over. If not, you won't be seeing this video. But it was a great, great game. Um, you know, the MVP of the game definitely is Mike Smith. Mike Smith at this moment has 14 points, 14 assists, uh, and two free throws coming up. So he should get to 15 or 16. Uh, you know... Just phenomenal looking for the passes and just being aggressive at the right moments. He's hit, he hit really clutch shots at the end of the game. Uh, he had a nice floater, a nice three, the two free throws that I just talked about. So he was just a phenomenal game for Mike Smith. Couldn't ask for a better one. Isaiah Livers was freezing cold today. Um, but, you know, it's actually a good sign that, you know, if Livers isn't playing well, the rest of the team can step up uh, and produce and win by, you know, 10 or more. Uh, so it's a very good sign going into March Madness for Michigan. Because, as I said, Livers is probably, you know, their best scorer, I would say. And, you know, him putting up zero points is very, very rare. Uh, and to see Michigan still win, even though against Maryland, is still a very good sign. Uh, Franz Wagner started off really, really slow, but heated up really quickly. And that's what he can do. And that's why he'll be a most likely lottery pick in this draft. You know, high lottery, like 13 to 14. Um, but still, the guy's a sophomore. He's been killing it. Uh, he has a great body for the NBA and can shoot the lights out. So, yeah, you will see him in the NBA next year. Eli Brooks, uh, who had an injury, came back strong. Um, didn't shoot the best, but again, just like Mike Smith, made some really, really clutch shots. Uh, and Hunter Dickinson, even though he didn't score much on offense, he just was a defensive beast. And big shout out to the bench. You know, Michigan usually runs. Sorry, I look up just to make sure Mike Smith hits these free throws, which he did. Um, but Michigan really runs like an eight to nine man rotation. And, you know, usually they don't rely on the bench that much. But today the bench played fantastic. They were kind of the catalyst as to how Michigan stay in the game. Because when Michigan was down by eight early on, the starters were doing nothing. The bench was carrying. Uh, so good job to Sean D. Brown specifically, uh, the backup point guard for Michigan. Really, really great game. Um, and then Brandon Johns uh, had, and and um, Austin Davis, just great games. So good job to Michigan. And then, you know, looking at Maryland, um, you know, I, I, I mean, Maryland, they just really couldn't find their shot in the second half. Um, I think they were like 0 for 12 from 3 to start the second half and then started hitting a few threes. Um, and if you go in a cold tree like that, especially against a, a team like Michigan, who A, could lock you down defensively and could score, you know, in a matter of three seconds on the offensive side, uh, that can't happen. Uh, that's a big reason why they lost. Yeah, this game's over. Michigan's going to win. Um, so, yeah, I mean... Just a great game. Jawan Howard did get ejected, like with 10 minutes left in the game. Uh, I'm interested to see what that was about because Jawan Howard's a very, you know, mellow guy. He never really, you know, lashes out like that. And he was really, really angry. So I'm interested to see what he says when he gets interviewed uh, after this game. So yeah, guys, uh, Mike Smith hit another shot. Um, this guy cannot be stopped. What a phenomenal game for him. Uh, you know, just really killed it offensively. Just really carried Michigan today. Uh, and yeah, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed. I guess it's another short or video um, as Maryland hits a three. So the game's not over, over, but 12 with two minutes left. This game is wraps. Um, Aliyah for Maryland. I don't know if I'm saying his name right. I'm very, very sorry. Uh, he had a good game for them. Uh, he shot the ball pretty, pretty well. And then looking at the box score quickly, um, Morcel uh, had a really, really great game for Maryland. So good for him. Uh, yeah, guys, that's really it. I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, Maryland and Michigan, I guess they are not friends because they were beefing this whole game. Like I said, Juwan Howard got ejected. We don't know if he was fighting with a coach or, or a player. Uh, and yeah, so Michigan moves on to the semifinals. This was the Big Ten tournament. Michigan will most likely be a number one seed either way. But um, yeah, try to win every single game, win the Big Ten tournament. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. We'll see who they play uh, very, very soon. 18-5 and 14 from Mike Smith with a minute and a half left. Phenomenal game. And yeah, guys, that's it. Gonna try to get this video up right when the game ends. So yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. 
Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed all the videos today. I worked hard on them. So yeah, leave them a like uh, if you enjoyed it. Uh, wow, Michigan, another three, two dagger game. Uh, I think it was Eli Brooks who came back from injury. Uh, yeah, guys, again, I've wrapped this video up 12 times, but this is it. Hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Bye, guys.